Well, for this year's project, I thought hydroelectric generator would be good. But since I didn't have the right parts, and we couldn't really find the right parts to build a good solid one, I decided to make it out of Legos. As you can see, it works pretty easily. Made a couple of modifications, lights. The LED turns on. And then I stop it, it stops. So, first, normally, the water would come in through this tube, go down and spin this water wheel. And there. And because I added the little teeth on so it would catch the water easier, and the crank is just for demonstration so I don't have to bring a high power hose down here. And over here, this is um, a gear ratio right down there in there of one to five. The big is one and the little is five. So this little one spins this right here. I'm going to take it apart for a second. Take. So, you take this off, you can see coils of wires, and um, the coils um, have an alternating current in them when this circle of magnets spins around them. So, the magnet, so the electrons in there start shaking like crazy when they try to... Um, uh, when they try to follow the magnets right here. And, the, so, it goes around and eventually comes out here, these two wires, and goes through here, and lights up the LED. And this, right here, this is um, the um, alternating magnets that help um, make the electrons go all berserk and go around. So, they, they um, alternate too, it, instead in poles. This one's north, south, north, south, north, south, north, south, north. Actually, I'm not sure that there were. So, if I put this on, wait, let's see it in action one more time. Whatever. So, I turn the crank. The water wheel spins. Gear ratio happens. These things turn. The wires, they know. Electrons go crazy. Come out. 